horrible angle. Who we got? Who is there this morning? You can get some people in here fast. Got some some stuff I need to get out so we can uh, try to help out. Harley's not even ready this morning. Where she's now, I don't know. Something about this time of year makes my head go round, takes me back, makes me wonder what she doing now. Well, for everybody, I want to show y'all something this morning, and I'm hoping... This will show up good. Let's see how it looks here. This is Michael Kessinger, and he has an active Amber Alert right now on January the 14th of 2022. This is Michael Kessinger. He has an active Amber Alert. He was last seen playing in the woods at his home. So... I'm going to play y'all a little clip, too, that kind of tells about it, if I can work out. If I can work this out, the glare's killing it. It's better over here. Can y'all see that? <sighs> There we go. Elijah Kessinger. This is Elijah Kessinger, and he has an active Amber Alert. I'm hoping y'all can hear this. Elijah Kessinger from Monroe County Items, zero, image dot alt photo by uh, Tennessee Bureau of Investigation by Bethany Davison. Posted at 7.42 is, p.m. There's January an active 13th, Amber Alert out for this kid. So, January 14th, I hope everybody will get a good, good look and keep your eyes open for Michael. Turn that crap off. I can't stand that when they let the robot read it and they, you can't tell what they're talking about. But this is um, Elijah Kinzinger. So everybody get a good look and keep your eye out for Elijah. Elijah became missing yesterday, I believe. It said he was playing in the woods outside of his home and they haven't seen him after that. Now I played when I was a kid, I played in the woods constantly i was building a fort every chance i got taking my dad's lumber and his i'm all in two before his head up so you out in the damn woods again building something uh you know what would cost boy my dad was kind of a tight tight guy good dude though miss you dad love you um who we got Carol, good morning. Tammy, good morning. Melinda, you learned how to use that alarm clock, didn't you? Good job. Good job. Everybody get a shot of uh, Elijah Kinsinger. Kinsinger? It's K-E-N-S-I-N-G-E-R. Kinsinger. 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 Elijah. We'll call him Elijah. Did y'all get a good look at him? Harley, do you see? Don't you give me the middle, Paul. What's wrong with you, girl? 
Harley is in an ill mood this morning. She on that land of dawn somewhere, I believe. I would have think I would have thought the dogs would have picked her picked her up if she was on the Wells property, so I don't know. You did see that, Michael. Or Elijah. I keep wanting to call him Michael. He reminds me of Michael Vaughn, who is still missing. I've been up since 545. Why so early this morning? Why the early riser? Want to share with the group, or is that something you're keeping to yourself? All right. Did y'all see my video I put out last night about the... Uh, police looking into them taking video of Robin's daughter and putting it on the internet. Did y'all see my video? You know that got two dislikes. I guess there's people out there that think that's cool. Amazing. It's an amazing world we live in. Good morning, Frisco Chick, Magenta Dreams, Sky Chan, Melinda Collier, Blondie, Juicy Fruit, Carol Smith, Tammy Brown. Good morning, everybody. Godmother. Good morning. It's kind of a catchy name, Godmother. Hey, you tell me what you're doing here and leave my family alone. Capiche? Godfather impersonation, dead on. This is crazy all around the same age of freaking New World Order, my theory. Hey, don't start that. Brandy watches some crazy stuff. Eh, I better not get into that. Brandy might uh, get upset with me. But it's some, uh, what would you call it? Conspiracy theory type information. They actually say that JFK Jr. is still alive and he's getting ready to come back and they're going to overthrow all this craziness that's going on. It's a wild story. But amen to that, um, Sky Chan. I don't know why you guys think I can't find nobody. I've been looking really hard, and even though I have no leads, no suspects, no evidence, no ideas, no hair, I'd like to say everything is still on the table. Persons of interest ain't got none. Suspects? What's a suspect? I, Ronnie Lawson, promise you, if you reelect me, eventually I will solve a case. Thank you very much. Uh, I don't see a ton of, uh, boy, you killed that Ronnie Lawson impersonation yet. I guess you're typing. Got big news for y'all. I know I should have released it by now, my Kyron Horman video. But man, John learned how to add clips into his videos. Uh, just a little preview of what's to come. I, Ronnie Lawson, would like somebody to solve this case so I can get reelected. Please. World of hurt. Oh, he'll get reelected. I guarantee it. Man, I'm not in Tennessee. I think there's a lot of corruption going on. And I tell you, man, all these missing kids in Tennessee seem to pop up. So regular. 
And don't get me wrong, I love Tennessee, and I like all the people I've met in Tennessee. However, it seems like there is an, a, a large kids reported large number of kids reported missing in Tennessee, or at least I hear about more than you know the average location. Gets me. Really need to look into the new world order theory is feeding to all these kids. Don't just disappear out there in the backyard. Carol Smith, I'm not saying it's an impossibility. You know, I like to keep my mind open to things. I wonder what the requirements are to run for sheriff in Tennessee. I wonder if you have to live in Tennessee or you could live in Bluefield, West Virginia and still run. Let me get up there in Hawkins County. I'll jerk a knot in some but rear ends. Who would vote for me if I ran for sheriff of Hawkins County? Give me a thumbs up if you would vote. John Davis, true crime for sheriff. I, I'm, I'm liable to get carried away. You give me that power. What do you mean you don't know? I got one vote. Two votes. Two votes for sheriff out of 20. Eh, it's not too bad. You know, Lorna Copia, you're right. You're right. It's just, I think why people are getting so impatient over this investigation, the Summer Wells investigation, is because all the nonsense that keeps going on. I think if there wasn't all that, noise around the case, people would be a little bit more patient with the investigation. But I think it's seeing people act a fool constantly that really gets on people's nerves. Wouldn't y'all agree with that? Let's see, I have one, two, three, four votes for sheriff. I have fixed my buffing issue for as long. You didn't fix your buffering issue? You still got it? I bet that drives you nuts. I hope it doesn't buffer me like in a weird position. Like I'm like. Well, that's it. I'm running for sheriff of Hawkins County. Ronnie ain't will be opposed this election. Or unopposed, I apologize. Coming for your job, Ronnie Lawson. No, you can't have my job. I want your job, Ronnie Lawson. I run unopposed. Don't be messing up my system. Well, join in, Melinda. Nobody's stopping you, girl. No, I haven't listened to Andy's call yet. Um, I've been really working on my Chiron video, man, polishing it up, really excited about it. And, um, I'm hoping y'all share the heck out of it. Andy, are you talking about Andy, um, Hunter's dad? Is that who you're talking about? Tammy Brown? Cause I, I don't know that a lot of people did watch that. Sky Chan, I agree. I believe Grandis knows something. I'll be right back. Get a coffee. Y'all uh, talk amongst yourselves.
Brandy, if, you, if you're at the store watching this, pick me up some uh, man coffee. I'm tired of drinking peppermint mocha floppa rocka, please. And uh, stop by Hardy's, grab me a sausage biscuit, too. I know, it's like everybody's named Andy around the uh, Summer Wells case. There's Jody Sue's old man. There's Candace's first husband. There's Hunter's old man. And he didn't say it was Andy, actually, if we're talking about the H thing. He said it was an A. Anthony, Andy, Andrew, uh, Antonio, Alex. I hate to say all that, but see the multiple name repeats in this story. Yeah. Well, all right. I hope everybody's found their uh, emojis. Who thinks it's extremely weird that there are three generations of Candace's so far? I find that so odd. You know, I've never. I, like Brandy, I think she was kind of open to me naming my first son as a uh, John Davis Crew Trime Jr. But I, I just think that I don't like that. I feel like it's narcissistic to name your child after you. And when a woman does it, that's really odd to me. That's the only time I have personally ever heard of somebody naming their daughter after them. And then their daughter names their daughter after them. Three generations of Candace's. That's so odd to me. Do y'all think that's odd? Thumbs up if that's odd. Who asked me another JDTC for sheriff? I have never heard of that either, man. I've never heard of women naming their daughters after them. Well, I say women, but maybe it's more um, common among tomboys. Uh, apparently, you can lose your kid these days and it's it's not that big of an issue. Yeah, Frisco Chick, it was George Foreman. He named all his sons George and there's like a ton of them. Could you imagine that? Like the mom at breakfast. Hey, George, did you do your homework? Yeah, 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 yeah. How odd would that be? Yeah, Carol, I've heard the middle names. I've seen that a lot, but I have never heard of naming your daughter after you. I wonder, I guess they can be a junior then, right? Candace Harrer Jr. Right? I mean, that's the way I see it. Thumbs up times two. All right. A curse. The curse of the no makeup crew. I was working on a joke about the situation where the big blow up was the night um, Jose was found or the night the Jose argument happened. And my joke was like that um, she had called the cops on Dom because he had a Nerf gun in his glove box and it would shoot eyeliner and lipstick, and she was scared to get hit with that. <laughs> is that juvenile or is that funny? I think it's funny. I wrote a whole comedy skit that I decided I better leave that alone. People could be upset. What'd y'all think about that, though? Is that funny? Oh, that was funny. Nobody? Nobody thinks it's funny? Let's do a checkup. Uh, Lornicopia, Magenta Dreams, Kathy, Frisco, Mag 
Blondie has my younger sister's first name, which is Summer. My youngest daughter has my younger sister's first name. Yeah, but that's different. That's that's a different situation. Okay, some of y'all got the joke. Welcome. Was his. Was his. Is that kind of a reference to you dumped your old man, so you named your uh, little avatar was his? Did I get, did I catch that? I'm an investigator over through and through. I was thinking about applying for me a private investigator's license or, you know, seeing what I had to do to get one. If it's not super hard and expensive. I would love to do that. I know I could crack some cases. Good morning, Dana Kay. Man, it's cool how some of y'all are really good with like decorating your stuff. How'd you get the butterflies beside your name? That's neat. Probably has to take real name down. Hmm. So was I right or was I wrong about the origin story? Was it odd that D made a point that he drove a hundred miles to get home because C was making him jealous? Only all hang out together partying before things blew up. Yes, it really is odd. That was part of my skit too. I said, uh, after I heard about this Jose character, I flew home. I didn't buy an airplane ticket, but at 120 miles an hour, who needs one? That's part of my skit too. Showing y'all a little bit of it to see. Always correct, JB. Who's JB? We're doing research for a PI here in Knoxville. It was truly interesting. Loved it. You know how hard it is to get a PI license, Tammy Brown? I just heard that all wrong. I need to go back to bed. You got the joke, didn't you? I thought the shooting uh, makeup with the Nerf gun was hilarious. Sixteen thumbs up. People's dropping out fast, though. I guess my comments are invisible this morning. Have a good one, y'all. See you tomorrow. Well, sorry, Blondie. Our goodness. Is that... She, yeah, she must have bailed, I guess. Um, never seen it on here either. Um, was he is sorry, Jay Davis. I'll wake up here in a minute. Okay, so it was JD you were going after. Or it's not difficult to have to carry ungodly insurance. Oh, yeah, I never thought about that. You know what I was thinking about doing? And it's going to take me a minute. And uh, a lot of y'all promised you would help me with some stuff, some research, but uh, nobody emailed me. Anyway, I was thinking about doing the best timeline I can and try to put everybody that even mentioned where something happened at a certain point, all that together and taking a look at it and see if maybe that would help at all. But the timeline is so sketchy that I don't know if you could actually get one that would be accurate. Good morning, Ramblin' Rome. There you are. Yeah, Carol. I, Carol, you're one of the ones that I have uh, trouble getting your stuff to open. I don't know why. I think I need to upgrade my computer. Like some of these, I'll sit there and click on it, and it'll do like the loading thing, and it will never open the files. Then some people's, I click on it and pop. Right there it is. All right, the numbers are going back up. Welcome, everybody. Is there anybody has a question this morning? Throw it on there and we'll answer it. You know? If anybody wants to do a super sticker, that'd be cool. 
not, J.D. True Crime may have to go do some J.D. True working. Damn. Had to go out and come back buffering. Really? That's y'all's internet. I'm pretty confident it's not mine because it only happens to some of you. And I know how aggravating that can be, too. I feel for you. I really do. Yeah. There's a couple that seem to have a lot of buffering issues, and I, I hate that form. I know it's annoying. It says upcoming chat. That's why no one knows it started. I don't know what the deal is. I always choose the time. It's always correct, and it'll still on there say um, something crazy. I just want everybody to know, until further notice, we're doing this Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So don't worry about if you don't get a notification. Just click on me at 9 on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and you'll be with us. So every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, until further notice, we'll be doing this. And I tell you, if it starts doing better, we'll do it more often than that if y'all want to. I'll do it every morning. I want to mention a couple things, though. Since Tennessee is derailing, all turning on each other. Yeah, ten, it, Summer's case is a mess. Um, earlier, I showed everybody a picture of Eliza, Elijah Kinzinger, and I want to show it again for the people that just arrived because this is Tennessee also. The TBI sent this out. There's an active Amber Alert right now. He just become missing yesterday, and there's a there's a look at Elijah Kinzinger. Everybody keep your eye open. TBI just put out the Amber Alert, and I hope this, this little guy gets found really soon, and I hope everybody will, um, you know, share, do whatever you can to get his face out there. They said he was playing in the woods, and they haven't seen him since. Yeah, Jenny Rose, you were exactly right. Rambling Rome, I made that same point this morning. I said, it seems like there are so many Amber Alerts that come out of Tennessee. Also, everybody, be prepared for this weekend because there is a good chance snow is going to hit the fan. It could be really bad. They're talking power outages, heavy ice, all that crap. So everybody this weekend, you know, stock you up on some groceries. You might want to leave after the live to do it. Don't leave before. It's not that important. Just kidding. Make sure you are stocked up, though. If you got a secondary source of heat that's not electric, do that. Kerosene heater, propane, whatever you got. Make sure you are stocked up for this weekend because it could get really bad. My kids are so upset that this is happening on the weekend as opposed to during the week and they can, you know, miss a little bit of school action. They're good, though. My kids all made the honor roll last time. I told y'all that, right? My theory is you keep them um, off drugs and uh, get them through college. And that's a pretty good parenting job, in my opinion. And mine are all going to go to college. Jenny Rose, good. I, I'm, I hope it misses you. But I tell you what, everybody should be a little prepared because you never know. Yeah, I know, Carol. They, I seen the other day where they said 15% of, like, things a store sell is out of stock due to this issue that Sleepy Joe can't seem to get straightened out. Oh, I didn't know there was three generations of Dons, too. Well, I knew there was Don Jr. I didn't know there was another one. Well, that's awesome, Frisco Chick. That's what I'm shooting for. You want to get them through school. 
wood for the stove, propane for the heaters, and generator on standby. You go, Jenny Rose. You know what I bought? If people don't have a lot of money to spend on a generator, I got a power inverter. And as long as your car is gassed up, you can get you an extension cord and you can run a couple things off of that. You can run you a couple lights. You could probably run your lights and a refrigerator if you got a big enough one. Mine's pretty big. I didn't realize Dawn was a junior. Angie Davis, good morning, cousin. Do y'all know me and Angie was cousins? I get so confused, man. It's like I, I'll respond to somebody and then I start forgetting who said what. But I love doing the lives. Are y'all having a good time this morning? I like how everybody talks to each other too, man. That's cool. Y'all should, I guess y'all are starting to get to know each other. We've been doing this so much. Uh, Angie, I hope um, the, the battle with addiction goes good. You know, just hang in there, man. And um, everybody say a prayer for Angie. Oh, Angie threw her maiden name out there. She wanted to make sure everybody knew that she wasn't really my cousin. Claiming you? I don't know you like that. J. Davis, true crime. You're a scam artist. There you go, Frisco chick. Good job. Well, I hope everything gets better, Angie. I really do. Good morning, Knight Rider 72. Knight Rider 72, is that your year of birth? Just wondering because that's close to mine. Oh, Angie said, I, we ain't cousins. It's my sister, Angie. Forgot to tell y'all that. Thank you, Angie. Ugh. Well, I hope you feel better, Dana. Where'd everybody else go? It's been the Angie Davis, Dana K show starting up. 17 thumbs up. I think some of y'all forgot to hit that thumbs up. I don't know how much that helps, but a lot of people seem to think it's a good idea to do it. So let's do it. We're at 17 thumbs up. Let's see if we can make it climb. 19. Boom. Come on. Come on. Let's go. 19 thumbs up. Do I hear 20? 19 thumbs up. Do I hear 20? 20 going once. 21. 21 thumbs up. Do I hear 22? I'm sorry. What'd you comment, Carol? I missed it. Michael Vaughn still missing from Idaho. Dan, Dan Olson, I, I agree. You know, Michael, there is never anything out on his case. I wish, ooh, 28 thumbs up. Booyah. There's never anything on Michael's case out there. And it's, it's really discouraging. And, I, you know, his mom went home when he disappeared. So I don't think she was involved. I wish she would try harder to get his name out there more. There's very little on Michael. Now your husband give you the Omicron. Maybe I would kick me to the curb for something like that. God, I just buffered on my end. I hope that don't start up. We'll be in deep trouble. Did I buffer on y'all too? Well, I guess I had to have, didn't I? What did y'all, um, what did y'all think of my Benny Dawn video? Did you like it? Let's rate my Benny Dawn video. One through ten. Ten being the high. 
highest, one being the lowest. Oh, I'm buffering again. Y'all bear with me, man. I don't know what all this buffering's about. 11. I like the way you think. It was an 11. And 8. What could I have improved on, Jenny Rose? You just didn't like the topic or what? Man, I don't know what all this buffering's about. I'm getting over the Kung flu. It's a bitch. Lasted about a week. Now, Tammy, some people find it offensive when you say Kung flu. However, I'm not one of those people, so feel free. Okay, Jeannie, I'll accept that. You're right. Nobody's perfect. I could have done better. I'm excited for y'all to see my Chiron video, though, man. I actually learned how to put clips in my videos. And I'm trying to learn um, if I can get in trouble for that. But it's, I don't understand this copyright stuff. Because it's like I see some people, they'll play a whole show. You know, and do nothing to it, not cut it up or anything. I do not get copyright. I don't get it. See, I was wanting to uh, video and put all of the weird faces Allie made during the interview. A lot of people brought up how it seemed like she was trying to give signals and stuff to Hunter when he was answering questions. I was going to make a whole video and just cut those out and show every time it happened. But uh, Chris has a big copyright thing at the beginning of his video, and I'm afraid he get mad at me. Even though I'm a big fan, big fan, McDonough. If you ever see this, big fan. Let's do it live together. Could y'all see me and McDonough doing a live together? Wouldn't that be awesome? The goat of true crime. I'm talking about McDonough. I'm not, I'm not no uh, narcissist. Well, not a big one, though. Um, I believe Mr. Wells' impression. I don't have a good Wells impression. I do a mean Ronnie Lawson. Well, thank you, Angie. How long would be like a choose your own adventure book? Exactly. And that's kind of how when you write your theory, when well, when I've wrote my theory, it's like you gotta choose your own adventure. Pick which one to believe. That's why it's so hard. I've been working on my theory forever. But I'm a I shoot holes in everything I, I put down. As long as we comment and discuss the video, it's fair use. Are you pretty sure about that, Frisco? It's a copyright, but cut clip and speak in between isn't. See, that's what I thought, too. I wasn't sure, though. If y'all are pretty sure about it, let me ask y'all this. I have some Dr. Phil in my Chiron video, but I don't have any piece that's over eight seconds long. Do you think I'll be okay with that? I don't know, Cindy Crockett. I've never heard of nobody finding bones. But what do y'all think? Is that a copyright issue if I only, if I keep it below eight, eight second clips? Y'all think I'll be all right? I got busted on my um, music video, but it wasn't like a big one. It was one of the things where uh, I have to share the money I make off of it. And I'm okay with that, you know, because I like making those. They're kind of fun. I should be okay, everybody. Everybody, if you think I'll be fine just keeping it to short clips, give me a thumbs up so I know everybody either agrees or disagrees. If you think I'm going to get in trouble for using clips, that are 10 seconds or under, give me a thumbs down. Thumbs up if you think I'll be all right. Thumbs down if you think I'm going to be in trouble. The chat's moving really slow. I think 
My internet ain't killing it this morning. Buffering, too bad for me. I'll catch you. Next one, don't forget, snow's coming. Buy more TP milk and bread, LMAO. Well, I'm sorry, Ramblin'. Um, my buffering's cut out now. Okay. Everybody seems to think I'll be all right. I hope y'all are really sure on that. Check on slow mode. Let me check that. Shouldn't be. Oh. Hold on. I don't want to screw it up. Okay, I think that should help. People whose clip you used credit. How do you do that? You just like say, uh, you add a little, just right in there, credit to, and then the people's clip you used. Is that all you got to do to be okay with that? Chatting ain't stopped. It's moving. It's a little slow. Y'all just bear with me a little bit. I, I turned it down. It should be fine now. I don't know what that means. Exactly. Um, hold on. Let's see if I can do. Oh, the chat did stop. I think. Oh no. Y'all bear with me just a second. fix it. Y'all hold on. If you can hear me or see me, just give it a second. And hopefully this will take care of it. <sighs> Come on, man. Straighten up. Y'all talk to me. Somebody say something. It should be okay now. Well, there I go again. <sighs> 